Welcome, welcome to all the growth learners out there. In this video, we're going to cover how to create progress bars in Google Sheets based on numbers that you input. We'll also cover how to create an overall progress bar based on all the individual items that you're tracking. To create progress bars like these in Google Sheets, use the sparkline function. We have our percentages of completion in column B, and let's add another column. And in column C, so type in equals, sparkline, select the cell in column B, comma, curly bracket, everything in quotation, chart type, comma, open quotation, bar, semicolon, type in your max value, 100%, semicolon, color 1 for the first color, the actual color or a hex code, semicolon, empty for how to treat empty cells, zero, close curly bracket and close the function. And then drag this cell all the way down for the other rows. To create an overall progress bar for all the items that you have, use the sum function to sum all the items that you have and divide it by the count of those items. You can change this to percent and then create a spark line for this progress. Open curly brackets, chart type, bar, semicolon, max, 100%, semicolon, color, green, semicolon, empty, to treat empty cells, zero, close curly brackets, close the function. That gives you your overall progress bar. Let's make the significant digits for the overall progress the same as the rest of the items. Now watch cell D8 and the overall progress in D2. As we update the progress, both progress bars update. If you found this video useful and want more content on improving your spreadsheet and Google Sheet skills, like, comment, subscribe, share to join the Growth Learner community. We'll see you in the next episode.